Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some Pioneer Slivers. And uh, let me take a look at this freaking hand. Wow. We got our, like, two worst lands that we could have in our deck. Yeah, we're going to mulligan. Uh, this is much more keepable, but who to cut? Probably a Gale Rider? Wow, that was my loud phone. Holy cow, eBay. Chill out, eBay. Chill out. We're going to keep... We're going to dump one of these. That's just how it's going to be done. I'm sorry. That's just it. All right. Mono White. Devotion is my assumption. Some bans just happened this week in a lot of formats, except Popper, by the way. Um, I don't think I play enough Pioneer to know the impact of how that is. <laughs> but I know uh, there was a lot of big bans. Uh, Earl was one of them. Uh, Modern, Pioneer, I believe, too. He was a big hit. And a bunch of other stuff, man. The new combo that from Kaldeheim with uh, Tybalt's Trickery or whatever it's called. That got banned, which that was taking over Modern and a bunch of formats really crazy. They're using one of our Cascade cards that we used to use in Gruel Slivers, which was pretty interesting. Our, uh, I forget the name of it. I don't follow it enough. I haven't played that mat that uh, that deck in a while. Alrighty, let's go ahead and start beefing up our boys with a metallic mimic. Unless they counter it. No counters here. Get in for one. Start racing a little bit. Boom. Next turn. I would love to be mana efficient, but I think our best bet is to play the leeching. Cracking a clue already at end of turn. Okie doke. So is this just is this just control now? White creature. No, this is like weird. Cost one less to cast. Create a warrior. Okay. Cool. Fair enough. So you know what we're going to do? We're going to go ahead and get this out of our hands. Say no. And go ahead and play our leeching. Start getting in for some good damage. Because they are setting up. And for what? I'm scared. I don't know. Haven't seen enough yet. As long as they keep tapping up and not holding up blue, I'll be fine with it. Tap them blues. Reflector mage. Oh boy, oh boy. Ah, uh, okay. What are you gonna put back to my hand? Probably my leeching or my gale rider might even be decent. But they're gonna do my leeching, so I can't play him for a turn. I haven't actually gone up against the reflector mage yet. I forget how it works. Till your next turn. Okay. Fair enough. Militia Bugler. Two cards left in hand. Another Militia Bugler. Alright. They want a race. A race they shall have. I'm about to put some lifelink down. That's going to be gnarly for them next turn. Just you wait. There ain't they're not killing us anytime soon, so uh I'm gonna keep pressure on. They got some work cut out for them. They can make a nice board. Especially with militia munich militia bugler next turn. They can make a bunch of warriors. Uh but it's twenty-one to nine. 
And I've got two leechings coming down that they don't know about. So. Scry away. That's actually pretty good in conjunction with Militia. Miller reveal. Look at the top four cards. So they could scry one. And if they don't see a creature, there's bottom it. Give them a better chance with Militia. It's nice. All right, play them. Play them. I don't want this on my screen no more. Come on. Come on. Oh, frick. You capture stuff, don't... Wait, what do you do? You may return another target creature you control to its owner's hand. If you do, you gain life equal to that's cover of mana card. Discard legendary, draw two cards. Okay. Interesting. So who are you bringing back? Alright, you're dead. You gonna die. You don't have another way to get mana, right? You don't have another way to bring him back out. Wait, you just two? Oh, they cost one less. That's right. Okay. That's fine. Um, they're still in rough shape. They gotta hit my Gale Rider here. Yeah. I forgot he gave one less. I was gonna say, are you really attacking? Into my 3 3? Like, okay. Fusion would be nice. Yeah, let's put down Diffusion. And we'll put down one Leeching. They won't know about the other Leeching. But this just gives us a little extra protection if they want to try to Reflector Mage something again, somehow. Pass through. Keep up some blockers, but they don't know about our other leeching, so we're just going to Gale Rider leeching and slam them. We had a good hand for them, but I feel like this is going to be a tough matchup. Um, unless this is really all they have, this doesn't seem that fast. I guess we're going to have to see. So now I'm starting to think this is just Pioneer's version of humans. But we keep going up against the tribal. We had spirits. Now we got humans. Definitely weaker than uh, Modern's version of humans. Do they have Thalia in Pioneer? Not Thalia. Uh, Thalia's captain? Captain thought Whatever it is. The one that gives counters. That one's always gnarly. Bugler. Revealing. Selfless spirit. Gotta watch out for this too. But they don't have enough for it this time. But they're prepping to do that. Little do they know though. Little do they know. I mean, can't we just kill him off the rip anyways? Not quite. We have nine on them, right? No, we have enough. I don't know what they're thinking then. We, we can just kill them. They know Gale Rider's coming. Gale Rider. Watch this. Gale Rider. Watch this. Leeching. Are we good? Are we good here? You have something that can stop me from doing what I'm about to do. No. I didn't think so. Alright, sideboard time. Uh, 
Fatal push seems reasonable. Um, first strike seems decent. What else do I want? I think I need shapers. Fusion's not as necessary. Although that was annoying. Maybe it actually will be good. Maybe I'll keep him. We'll cut Siphon. He's not super necessary. Ah, yeah, striking I guess isn't super necessary either. We can usually beat their board. Let's run it like this. Run in the fatal pushes. And... Is that all we did? Really? We cut the other stuff? It's fine, really. I'm fine with that. <clears throat> Can't think if there's anything else we'd want to bring in. I need to update my sideboard. Let me know. If you guys are playing Pioneer, tell me what the meta is. Uh, let me know what sideboard cards might be decent with this new meta, because I think I have a couple empty spaces that I'm just cards I'm not using that we can do better on. I'll keep it. It's uh, dependent on if we keep drawing lands here. But it's not bad. Go to uh, Metallic into Diffusion. And that's going to slow them up a few turns to play their guy on our stuff. Go. Icon will be nice, too. The Raven is fine. Start with this. Go. Cracking a clue. We're repeating last game, which is always a good sign, honestly. They did not draw a land that is huge, honestly. Honestly? Honestly. It's huge. Oh, but what to play? What to play? So many options. Hmm. So many options, so many things to do. I think... I think I'm just going to do the diffusion play. Um, and then we're going to start really putting some nasty stuff down next turn. We can do a Realm Walker. We can do a Sentinel. We can do whatever. I'm not trading with the Thraben right now. And if they don't get a land here, they're Toast. Oh, and their name is Toaster X42. I didn't say their name at the beginning, but yeah, if they don't find a land here, they're really in bad shape. If they don't find a land, I'm putting down Bone Slith. I'm just slamming it. And they're going to be in trouble. Prince Charming. So they can get another clue. Or they're going to scry and gain a life. Okay. They're going to scry too. They got to find that land. Prince Charming. What a staple this guy has become, huh? Who would have thunk? He has a good card. Muta Vault, huh? You don't say. I'll put you down. All right. I can attack into all you guys. Bink, bink. That's double strike. Get in there. Ouch. That feels good, huh? They found their third land, but again, diffusion first is going to cock block them from doing this. Because this isn't going to work. Right? Because I got to target it. Boom. It's not going to work countered 
see you later rip and concede there we go perfect that was great <laughs> Leave a great like on this video for that play. That was an awesome game. We keep getting the tribals, and I love it. I do love it, but I hate to say it. Spirits has to beat humans. You guys got to die first and become some spirits to get a, to become a good tribal deck in Pioneer. Uh, your modern version is way, 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 way better. Just convert to spirits or slivers. Either one's fine. But that was pretty weak. Weak showing for humans. Sorry, hate to say it. All right, leave a like, subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. We will see you guys in the next video.